thought I'd do a quick video here on uh, how I rig up for Cobia. Uh, I'm probably not going to actually rig anything up uh, because it is fairly straightforward. Uh, this is just a four ounce bucktail jig uh, with a eight inch gotcha uh, curly tail grub. Uh, dependent on you know what I'm fishing for, how big the fish are, uh, I might step down to a two inch. Uh, this is just, or, I'm sorry, a two ounce uh, jig head with a skirt, and then I have some smaller uh, big bites. Uh, and you can you can vary the uh, the sizes or the uh, colors, whatever you feel like doing. I mean, just a real simple just something to give it a little extra you know, a little, little flash uh, and you can use the bigger grubs with that as well uh, and then I also have some step down to some one ounce uh, bucktail jigs uh, with those you can you can throw them with the trailer uh, now if I'm offshore and I see a bunch of uh, mahi some dolphin or uh, some cobia hanging out uh, this right here is 150 pound mono uh, I leave the eye uh, and then I use a uh, heavy heavy gauge uh, snap swivel on all my offshore stuff that way I can switch it in and out um, if I see some uh, if the cobia are being kind of finicky I'll just uh, straight rig with a crimp into a uh, large hook and then throw out some live bait if uh, they don't feel like hitting the jigs. Um, dolphin, uh, it just depends on what they're wanting. Uh, a lot of times I will rig up with uh, fluorocarbon, uh, which I can at a later point do a, a video for a uh, either a uni to uni uh, knot or uh, you can actually crimp it as well uh, or tie it into a uh, barrel swivel. Uh, other than that it's pretty straightforward just a straight uh, this is about a two foot uh, straight uh, mono leader with crimps on each end. Uh, yeah hopefully that's helpful.